Hey, what's up everyone, welcome back to another video. And there's been circling on the internet that there are some guys installing full Windows, at least for now, Windows 8.1 on some Lumias. And many of you guys were asking, uh, do a tutorial on how to install, you should do a tutorial. Uh, will I be able to install on my Lumia, etc, etc. <laughs> and let me explain you first. I have here my Lumia 640 XL waiting to try out, but for the moment this project is still in development. Until a few days ago uh, the touchscreen wasn't working, now the touchscreen is, is working. There will be a lot of bugs, there will be problems with drivers, but these guys that are working, installing full windows on Lumius, they are working on it. Once it will be ready, of course, I'm gonna show you a tutorial on how to install. Because, well, I love to make tutorials and all of you know me already that when I make tutorials, I like to make them straight to the points, no bullshitting around. But for the moment, don't waste your time and search on the internet on how to install it or how to unlock your phone, etc, etc, because it's not possible for the moment. What is possible for the moment is you can unlock your Lumia uh, and do whatever you want with it, but for the moment you will not be able to install full Windows uh, on it because, well, it's not available uh, for the public yet. I'm waiting also a little, maybe there will be some chances once uh, Windows 8.1 will be uh, running successfully on Lumius, um, they will try as well with Windows 10 uh, or Windows 10 S. But there's a slight problem with Windows 10 because Windows 10 requires uh, to be installed on 64-bit processor. But of course, the Lumius doesn't have also the requirements of Windows 8.1. But Windows 8.1 could be installed on lower processors, while Windows 10 uh, not so much. But uh, I bet they will find a way. I'm more excited about Windows 10 than Windows 8.1, but still, Windows 8.1 it's still a good option. I was always saying that Microsoft should give us or should give a phone uh, with Windows, with full Windows on it, but of course have like uh, as a button. Like on PC, there's a button to switch from tablet mode and desktop mode. So I was always saying that Microsoft should give us like as well a full OS on phones. And with a button or with a switch that like you can switch from mobile to full desktop. And yeah, there are also negatives of having full Windows on a phone because, well, the battery will be pretty damn bad. But yeah, as we see, Microsoft is working on this new Windows 10 S or for these ARM devices, which everyone is saying that they are, they, they are having a great battery life. And it's definitely not impossible. And maybe in the future, we're gonna get what we are asking for. For now, don't waste your time in searching uh, what to do and how to install because it's not possible. Once it will be available, I'm gonna install it and I'm gonna show you the tutorial on how to do it by yourself. Until then, thank you guys for watching and see you in the next one. Over